In this video, I'm going to show you how to calculate p-value using the t-test function in Google Sheets. So in this example, I have two sets of data for individuals. I have their body weight and the calories they consume per day, and I want to calculate a p-value for this data. So I'm going to use the t-test function. This is the syntax of the t-test function. Um, the first parameter is range, which is um, the first set of data used in the t-test. Um, the second parameter is the second range, which is going to be the second set of data. And then there's tails. So this is where you specify the number of distribution tails. So you're either going to be using a 1 or a 2. A 1 will be a one-tailed distribution. A 2 will be a two-tailed distribution. And then the last parameter is type, which um, tells Google Sheets the type of t-test you want to do. So you can either use a 1 for a paired test, 2 for a 2-sample equal variance test, or 3 for a 2-sample unequal variance test. So it's pretty quick to do this in Google Sheets. I'll just show you um, with this data. So I'm going to go in this cell equals t-test. And then the first is my range, comma, I'm going to select well, my second set of data, comma, and then I want to do one tailed distribution. So I'm going to do one, and I'm going to do a two sample unequal variance test. So I'm going to do three, and then put my closing parentheses and enter. And that is my p value. Um, so Doing t-tests is pretty quick in Google Sheets. If you're used to doing this manually, this is going to save you a lot of time. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments, and I'll try my best to answer everyone.